Hi, I'm going to do a quick little video on a new toy that I got in the mail. It is a EEPROM programmer. Uh, EEPROM stands for Erasable Programmable Read-Only Memory. And these are, um, you know, chips that the uh, various game systems use and arcade machines. Uh, with this, I'll be able to make my own, you know, customizations to... Uh, video games like the NES or Super Nintendo, um, Sega Genesis, arcade machines, um, that type of thing, and I can actually program them so I can run it on original hardware. Uh, you know, some difficult games to find or Japanese translations that have been done with a ROM, a ROM hack, I'll be able to put them on an actual cartridge, you know, and play them in the game system. So I'm just going to open this up and we're going to see what came in the package. So I'm really excited to have this because now I can, you know, repair arcade machines. I can also use this for flashing ROMs for like motherboard BIOS chips. Um, some TVs will even use custom firmware. So this will be extremely handy to have. So let's see what comes in the package. Ooh, popcorn! Yep, so that comes in there. Yicky. Is that? Let's see if there's anything else in there other than these damn things. Like we have another cable at the bottom. The rest is just popcorn. I will clean up my mess. Yeah, so this will be pretty sweet. And this will go right into my whole. NES hacking series that I plan on doing. If you didn't catch my first video, go check it out. Okay, so it looks like we have a USB cable. Super duper. A um, extremely generic burnt CD with the PCB 6.0e software for controlling this device. More packaging. When I really tape this up, looks like I have adapters for different chips. Normally you have to buy these separately, but this came included, which is excellent. We'll go over these briefly in a moment. Tape. So much tape. Make sure I'm not going to cut any wires. That would suck. So this actually runs on the old parallel style cable. Uh, you get these on like old printers and such. These guys here. Yep, so that'll be cool to have. I'll probably have to uh, use one of my junk computers to build a uh, programming box.
you know, basic Windows XP or something on there. And this taped up quite well. Come on, Skip, let's mummify it and tape before we ship it. At least they use nice packing. That's good. All right, and then place this on a piece of foam here. And here it is. This is our EEPROM programmer. So this thing can program a slew of devices. I have some um, EE proms coming in. Those are uh, electrically erasable, programmable, read-only memory chips. So yeah, that's it. Basically, uh, we can power this via the USB or a wall wart. This is uh, for power only. So is isn't really data. And um, all our data will go through this parallel port connector here so we can program our chips. Basically set the chip on here and you lock it down like so. And then um, you'll be using, I'll be using the software provided here to uh, send the ROM data into the actual ICs and then we can solder those into cartridges, motherboards, or arcade machine PCBs to uh, run our own custom software on original equipment. So yeah, that's just a quick video. That's my new toy. This is just a adapter so I can flash smaller chips. Same with this one. Just an, another adapter that we can use to flash smaller ROMs, EEPROM chips. Alright, well that's it. Just a quick little update video. That's my toy, and we'll see you later. Bye!